ISIS fanatic plotted to kill Theresa May in Downing Street suicide bombing. An ISIS fanatic planned to kill Theresa May in a suicide bombing outside Downing Street, a court heard today. Nimr Rahman, 20, plotted to detonate explosives at the security gates of No. 10 in a full frontal assault and kill the Prime Minister on November 28 last year, it is alleged. Rahman modified his coat and backpack with eyes and was arrested just days before he intended to carry out the attack by the Met's counter-terrorism police in Kensington, jurors heard. The Bangladeshi British terror suspect appeared at the Old Bailey today alongside 22-year-old Mohammed Imran for the first day of their trial. Imran planned to join the Islamic State in Libya after saving up £3,600 and obtaining a fake passport to leave the UK it is alleged. He is also accused of possessing a popular terrorist manual called How to Survive in the West, a Mujahid's Guide, published in 2015. Prosecutor Mark Haywood QC said, the case against them is that their shared inspiration, which comes from a warped ideology of the group that calls itself Islamic State, led them well beyond contemplation and into making plans and taking practical steps to engage in violent acts of terrorism. Both Rahman and Imran thought about going to a conflict zone such as Syria to lend support to the violence, said Mr. Haywood. From October 2015 Rahman was known to the Channel program, intended for people who may be exposed to radicalization, but had withdrawn from any engagement with that program and refused any further contact or assistance by the time of the alleged terror plot, the court heard. His settled conclusion was that lethal violence here directed at the very heart of the United Kingdom government, was the only effective way to pursue his intentions, said Mr. Haywood. Before his arrest prevented it he was, he believed, just days away from his objective, which was no less than a suicide attack, by blade and explosion, on Downing Street and, if he could possibly achieve it, upon the Prime Minister herself, Theresa May. Rahman's uncle had already traveled to Syria and joined Islamic State and was killed in a drone strike, the court heard. Rahman later told others that he had been encouraged by his uncle to do violent acts here in the United Kingdom, said Mr. Haywood. The evidence shows that his resolve to do so became hardened over time, especially after his uncle was among those killed in a drone strike. Imran, a former student at South and City College, Birmingham, is also accused of keeping an ISIS sponsorship video filmed by Rahman. Rahman, of Ballard's Lane, Finchley, North London, denies preparing to commit terrorist acts, and one count of intending to assist Mohammed Imran with terrorist acts. Imran, of Almbursley Road, Birmingham, denies one count of preparing to commit acts of terrorism and one count of possession of a document likely to be useful to a person preparing an act of terrorism. The trial continues.